The bell tower rising over St. Mark's Square in Venice is not the original, but its exact replica, built after the first collapse to the ground in 1902. During reconstruction, the tower's foundation was encased with 3,000 wood piles laid over with large blocks of Istria stone and trachyte. However, the old foundation and the new containment system failed to bond properly, resulting in an uneven distribution of loads, cracks to the structure, and a slight leaning. Though the damage does not endanger the tower, the natural corrosion of the piles by the brackish water and the micro-vibrations generated by the flow of tourists have aggravated the situation, prompting call for intervention to assure its long-term stability. After analyses by Venetian authorities, it was decided to strengthen the foundation. The project entails wrapping the existing foundation with a double system of six centimeter thick titanium rods at 40 centimeters and two and a half meters below ground. These rods, in turn, will be anchored to specially molded blocks serving as a counterbalance. Commissioning the project is the consortium Venezia Nuova, which subcontracted the special ground engineering works to Trevi. Trevi's role will be to perform the micropiling to allow excavation of seven chambers four meters under the pavement to allow installation of the titanium rods and the blocks. Site conditions also include a water table of almost four meters, so Trevi will employ in situ wet soiling mixing techniques for the micropiles using a Soilmec SM21 micro drilling rig. A special challenge, in fact, was to bring this machine to the site. In August 2009, the rig was transported by barge to the landing at St. Mark's Square, then conveyed 160 meters to the work site on a platform specially built to distribute its 22 tons. The rig was transported in four stages, 40 meters at a time, with the platform disassembled, then reassembled in front of the machine. Using this method, the distance to the site was covered in less than a week. Completion of the works is scheduled between late 2011 and early 2012.